Coming up on uh, 7 o'clock on a Wednesday evening. By the way, PDX hit my forecast high today of 52 degrees. Always exciting as a forecaster when you put out a number and you hit that number exactly right. Doesn't happen all that often. Okay. Here we go. You see the weather system offshore and the uh, infrared satellite picture. It still looks like this thing right here will produce um, up to about a quarter of an inch of rain. The latest timing on it says we're dry when we wake up tomorrow morning. And then maybe rain starts to arrive around 10 o'clock. Certainly raining into Portland by the noon hour. And then maybe three or four hours of fairly steady rain through the heart of the afternoon. And then that breaks up into showers by dinner time. And if all that plays out the way I think it's going to, we end up getting about a quarter of an inch of rain. Uh, let me take this out of here and go ahead and get you back to my seven day forecast. Here we go. Bam. All right. No big changes to my seven day, by the way. Uh, tomorrow will be in the 40s with the rain that I mentioned. Friday still looks like a day that has some scattered showers, but not a lot. There are signs tonight that maybe this moisture ahead of Saturday starts to come in Friday evening. If that's true, a few scattered daytime showers Friday would turn into increasing showers Friday evening into the overnight. Not sure about that yet. Saturday still looks like a day that could bring about a half of an inch of rain, maybe six tenths, a little bit more. I don't think it's steady rain all day long, but certainly numerous showers. The cold front timing is still in the evening, so if you have plans Saturday evening, that would be the overall best bet for a, you know, a rain band to be coming through. And then Sunday, scattered showers that might just about end by mid-afternoon. Now, the air is cold aloft, so even if we become mostly dry, there could still be some spotty, heavy showers producing some small hail that Sunday. Then dry weather Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe even Thursday of next week. Look at these lows, though. This will be the first time that Portland uh, will see back-to-back -back freezing temperatures. So that's a cold start to next week, although a dry one expected. And a reminder to go to my Mount Hood page, scroll down to my big blue forecast graphic, and then on the bottom of this, you can see the snow level. So let me move over here. 5,000 feet tomorrow, uh, down to 4,500 feet. If that's correct, we would basically see rain or a wet mix at government camp, but the resorts are 5,000 feet higher, maybe six inches. Saturday, look at this, six to 10 inches of snow. That's a big day. Mount Hood Resorts announcing, by the way, today that they will be open, at least Meadows and Timberline, over the weekend. And real quick, a shout out to the folks uh, out at Hillcrest. Um, if you're a skier, I'm sure you're familiar with these folks. They have that beautiful store out in Gresham on your way out of town up to the mountain. Um, they are the new sponsor of my five-day forecast, so I thank them for their support. And we have a new camera, by the way, coming to Valiant's Ski Shop up at Government Camp. Hope to have that for you soon. Very exciting news. I'll talk to you tomorrow.